What's up guys, I'm Thanos from Mercy Therapy Team and today I do a new project um, breaking in my motor it's brassed as you can see and so heavy so I took off the motor of my vehicle uh, to just break it into water um, this actually uh, some of you guys tell that I'm going to destroy my motor but I have to tell you that every brass motor is waterproof um, despite what um, um, from which brand it is um, so um, breaking, breaking in uh, the motor into the water uh, is an action that will increase your performance your motor's performance up to 20 uh, percent um, so as you can see if you uh, uh, if you just pull this away it's uh, pretty hard to do so what I'm going to do uh, is just to uh, take out the pinion gear um, so yeah let's take it off uh, a note I have to make is that this works only on brass motor. You will destroy your brass motor if you uh, do this action. Um, as you can see, I have here uh, the B rings. And you will need a, um, a, a glass of water. It must be the water must be clean because if it's it hits dirty. Um, it will make the brushes dirtier and you will just um, uh, do the same if you will change it off. So I have to just take off the dust a little. Not to take off. Especially uh, you can do this on your crawler, on your truck, on your truck, your buggy, and drift cars doesn't need this. Especially you. Uh, you have to done this um, on these tracks with the speed is necessary so what you're gonna do is just take a uh, here of the glass of water just uh, open the connect the battery with the ask and let me take the radiant control right just take off the electronic because it is for water. So what you're gonna need is just to um, open the uh, your RC. Basically, you see that. Okay, we have an auto brake here. Let me make the roll. Oh my God! Okay, sorry for that. I have to just make some changes here. Right, what you're gonna need is just to uh, put it into the water and just with the throttle put it in the middle. And it will make this edge inside the water. Leave it between 30 seconds with this, uh, this the same speed watch out uh, the water not to go in the electronics and try something right here okay so take up and with the higher Higher speed now.
Okay, and just some like full speed and just put the speed in the middle. That's good. Close the uh, radio control, all the things, and just uh, take out the motor. It will just go. As you can see, the water is uh, a lot of dust inside. Uh, this actually helps helps the uh, brushes to be clean, and also your motor. See. And what you have to do next is just to take um, a mechanic oil and put here in the bearings and and here in back, and then uh, replace the pinion gear. And also, if you have a cooler up here, uh, so uh, this action will increase the performance of your uh, RC car up to twenty percent. Um, you have. You can dump this with the water more and more, but as you can see here, it's so dirty. So you need to just replace it with a new one. Just clean it. So that was the breaking water method, um, just to uh, clean and actually rebuild the motor, the brass motor. I have to tell you again that. This doesn't work on brassless motor. You'll destroy your brassless motor if you do this braking motor. And don't worry about if it's brassless. I have to tell you again and again that uh, all the brass motor are waterproof. And then replace again, mount it again on your chases, and run your track and see the difference. Uh, this actually is my first time, so I will just capture a video and. I will realize if that uh, helps more uh, the RC car with the performance. Um, I saw a lot of videos on YouTube, um, which uh, a lot of people say that um, this increase uh, the speed and they have seen a difference. Um, so I'm going to do the same and stay tuned to our channel and see more videos about our RC stuff. Thanks for watching.